Hey guys, Fox1989 back again with another episode of Diddy Kong Racing. Now I've been doing some uh, playing around in the um, track section, and I've actually beaten TT on every single track now except for. Okay, I suppose I should say except for the hidden one. And the best part is I did it with Tip Top, who is the second slowest character in the game. With only Pipsy being slightly ever so slightly sl uh, slower. However, I still have to beat Whizpig. I haven't done that yet. Hello, um, Select your vehicle. So we're gonna go ahead and see if we can try the game again, because last time we unfortunately just couldn't do it. But now that I've had some practice beating TT, because TT is not easy to beat, he is the fastest character in the game. I can beat TT beating this pitch be no problem. Yo! I almost had him right on the first lap. And they didn't even get a full boost either. Careful not to draw, uh, drop on the grass because that does slow you down quite a bit. Oh, bacon butt. Ah, just too fast. Did I just call him bacon butt? <laughs> that just hit me. <laughs> uh, that was not planned, that just kind of came out. Ah, what the hell, I like crashed into his foot. No, shh. Probably still could have won, but I'm not going to risk it. Why waste more of your time than needed? Why can't I get my blue, uh, turbo boost? I just got it like every single time in a row when facing TT. Uh, sorry, I've got not much commentary to say here, because I'm actually not even sure whether I'm going to upload the episode where I just face him repeatedly for like 20 minutes, or not, but uh, yeah, I did, so I kind of went over all my commentary there. I can't tell if that would have been a win for me or not, because... Uh, kind of passed me like just so you're getting the finish line. Woo, that was close. No! I forgot about the stupid booster on that one. No! <laughs> Alright, I suppose time to just stop pretending that we was just go ahead and beat him.
I was watching somebody do a speed run of this the other day, and uh, when he beat this Wiz Peg using, of course, TT, the fastest character in the game, um, he actually had uh, almost lapped him. He was only a, a quarter of a lap from lapping him. Fuck you, bacon butt, I win. I thought I was going to throw the match because I missed that thing that went in the water, but I had enough of the lead, I figured I can do it. Well, I win with it. Because he lost a little way, his whiz pig goes far, far away and never returns. The world is safe. This is a kid's game. <laughs> Love how you can see the seams in the sky where the skyboxes are combined. And like how Whispick just spawns in there, like he wasn't actually hot behind behind before. I like how the ship's just floating there until uh, you the can't repatch the right position for it to come in. Occasionally the water's clipping through the ground. Even though he showed up to Terra's party lot one last time, Whizpig is gone and he's no more. Right? I like how they reuse the credits music as a uh, track music for. Uh, one of the later, uh, tracks. I thought that said wankly, you're like, what? Hey look, it's the club. <laughs> and lob. Yeah. 
end. So that was a cheat. Um, a lot of people know this, when you beat the game, you're given one random cheat. For example, um, Rocket Fuel will change all of the balloons on the course to blue balloon. Or Toxic Offender will do it all for green balloons. Or, um, let's see, Blabbermouth makes your horn sound be a random character sound. So if you go to Options, go to Magic Codes, you can then put in a code. If you put in uh, Vitamin A or something like that, it uh, has no limit to bananas. No! Go away, monkey boy! Nobody likes you! And here's our secret world. Wait, I have to go to the board. There's still one more world to go, and that's Future Funland. Now, I'm just going to show you how you access, um, how you would get TT. And you turn on Time Trial, and it's only active for one course, by the way. And let's do... let's do Star City. Or not. I just have no choice but to space this out. I just realized the balloon counts. So you see the TT in the corner there. He's going to be counting off the time. So basically, it's you have to uh, simply get the best time you can. If you surpass a certain time, you do it again, and TT will be on the track as a race ghost. If you can beat his race ghost, then you can actually unlock him as a character should you beat all of his race ghosts on every track. <laughs> Just as a note, I've never actually put forth the effort to unlock TT before. Because Back when I was younger and I was not as good at this game, he actually was incredibly hard to beat. Even now, I've actually been sitting here repeating like the same tracks like 15 times in a couple cases. I know Greenwood Village gave me a little bit of trouble. Um, a lot of Dino Domain did. But actually, a lot of the other tracks I didn't really have much trouble beating at all, actually, now I think about it. I like how he gets bashed by a frickin' uh, asteroid and just you no know, fucks were given. Okay, so once you beat a specific time, 
you do it again, Space and voila. See the Chi Chi Ghost? Time. Plus, you have your past race time as well. Those will stay on until you reset the console. <laughs> So now I'm not only racing against the clock, ha ha ha, but I'm also racing against my own previous time. That's a joke, because TT is a giant clock. Oh, I uh, went to look at my, uh, went to look at the time, and I wasn't paying attention. This was, that was a very bad time to actually look at the, uh, Okay, looks like TT's right on my ass, and my ghost is like behind a bit. It's kind of hard to tell apart because TT's a light gray, and then the ghost is dark gray. And holy crap, TT's in front of me! No, that's not what I want to do. I was trying to do a bell roll, but apparently it didn't catch. Look how fast he's going, he's catching up on me like really easy. Because he's just an insanely fast character and holy crap I missed that. Like when you rate the uh, speed of the characters in say stars, the DS version actually used bananas, but stars. Um, Tip top is, as I said before, a five star acceleration, five star turning, one star speed. TT, when you unlock him, is five star speed, five star turning, five star acceleration. So he's quite hard to beat. So once you beat him again, you have to do it on every track. Once you do every track, then that's how you unlock TT. Now, as you can see, that didn't actually count for my balloon, so we're still set to go for our next uh, our next episode. But I guess I'll have to see you then, because this episode is now over. Thanks for watching and thanks for listening. I'm Fox1989, signing off.